Hello, uh, this is Okami Universal. Today we're going to be doing some, uh, some boss fight, I guess. Uh, first in this little series of boss fights, um, we are going to be fighting Laku and Naku. Which one should we do first? Uh, I believe it's Laku or Laku and Naku. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, just here we will begin <coughs> our epic adventure of epicness. So here we are in the Wacky Shrine, and oddly enough, uh, I never actually got those chests, and I'm not gonna do that either now, so. <laughs> Uh, at this point I could put the solar flare on, but I really don't like it, because on the Wii version it's really hard to work the solar flares. But anyways, so once you come out here, you can see the half moon, and the gate closes behind you. And you have those really unrealistic yet nostalgic flames. And you jump up to be attacked by ice creatures. And there you have Mr. Lechku. And you have that really epic boss banjo. Thing. This guy doesn't waste any time. I like his style, don't we all? He's a mechanical silver owl with an eyeglass. You cannot even. No, you just cannot. It's just too tight. Alrighty. Oh, yeah, wow. Okay, I never really knew their names. So, Neku. I always got confused. Neku's the silver one. And, yeah. Neku's the gold one. So, with me, I had the pretty much. Founder of Zelda Universal. Shout out to our third branch of Universal <laughs> uh, <laughs> video ish areas. Kind of cool. So he just kind of flies up. And. Hey. Oh, wait, this is really, really intense. Look at this. I don't even know how this happened. This is so random. <laughs> Kinda random. Yeah, I know. Like, I think it came through the spirit gate or something. Shirandy we people. Yeah, he doesn't. No one gets it. <laughs> I don't even know how it got there in the first place. But it, like, owns Neku, so. That's okay. Yeah, see? That's, and basically. That's what it looks like when you use your thing. Try to get you off again. There you go. <laughs> and I can fight alongside Shirani. Yeah, see. So in the boss battle, the and... <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, I haven't done this in a while, so I'm not really sure how it's supposed to pan out exactly. Assuming that you just kind of okay. Oh, that works. So I guess you just wait. Uh, I'm trying to remember. <laughs> yeah. Ah! Damn it! Damn it! All right. <coughs> Damn it! What the hell are you doing? Get on and train me. Okay. Damn it! Not very accurate. Uh, it's yeah, it's really complicated. Okay, the, oh snap! I forgot he can use his extremely intense upgraded wind power. Yeah, if you yeah, if you really do a little thing, you can let him do what he needs to do. See, he has a he like howls every single time he does something like that. Clearly, he's just really intense. His power slash slashes like freaking ten times. I don't even. I don't even know. Yeah, go sure anyway. So you can basically just sit by and every single. Yeah. <laughs> you can just sit by and let him murk him. It's kind of random. It's pretty cool though. 
Uh, this part is actually really cool. I'm just gonna shut up now because it's extremely awesome. <laughs> This is where it gets weird. <laughs> and next. <laughs> and then comes Oki on Lucky's face. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Smashing through the wall. He's just going crazy with Keaton up there. And there's Lucky. That is indeed Oki. <laughs> One. I just think Oki is the most like tank owned Lena tried person. He's just really awesome. It's not his fault. I'm gonna finish you off this time. He's on shop like silver once more. He always talks about like shattering the wall of ice and crap like that. So yeah. Oh this part's really cool. I'm gonna show that one. This is really cool. Yeah. This is a really cool part. And there you go, turning into a wolf. So now you have three wolves and two big birds who are mechanical. Oh, oh, look who's stopping him. Sure, anyway. Oh, damn. Feisty ass tiger. This is this is why Oki says don't do it, you freaking retard. Saved Oki, yet when time was stopped, yet got stabbed pretty much. She got stabbed and then sliced both of the demons up quite nicely. And this is where Oki's in like an extremely intense situation. Either save Shiranui so we can go back and face Arashi, or finish off the demons. Very tough decision. Very tough indeed. It's alright though. He makes the right one. <laughs> Just like glitching up in the distance. But, um. Ah, uh, oh yeah, his sword glows silver because... Silvery blue? Oh yeah, because apparently his, what it actually needed to do was he needed to be a good person rather than like a selfish murderer. <laughs> Anyways, what I find really cool about this is after, um, after facing uh, Laku and Neku and getting severely damaged, uh, and going back in time, this is kind of a spoiler, when she goes back to her time, that's when she fights Arachi after already being severely injured. So it's kind of cool to think about that, how like it's just an infinite loop. And yeah, so that's kind of cool. Uh, yeah, because it's kind of like, like, the only reason that Arachi like completely pwned her is because she was already severely injured from getting like stabbed by Leku and Neku, so. And this is kinda random also. This is like a controversy between like me and my cousin person. Is um I think that the twin demons are pronounced Leku and Neku. But according to him, they're pronounced Lechku and Nechku. I'm not really sure what the proper pronunciation is, but if anyone knows, I can nice. Yeah, 
right now, right there. And that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, nice long video. 48,000 yen, not bad. Um, we have the amulet coin on, we're giving us more. I'm just kidding. Uh, so yeah, there's Oki and uh, Shrandy. Shrandy's pretty injured. And yeah, so see you guys next time. We'll probably be fighting Laku and Neku. Alright, see you guys next time. Alright guys, sorry I forgot to mention, uh, this is kinda random, it has to do with the storyline, after defeating Laku and Neku, uh, actually that weird pinwheel thing that came off, um, Neku, uh, it's just laying on the ground and what you actually want to do is come over and pick it up, it's like right over here. It's a gear. Yeah, weird ass thing, and it's actually a key for the locked door that's down there, so. You wanna get back? Yeah, if you wanna... I forget what to do here, but yeah. So that's just kind of neat. I'm pretty sure you just talk to Oki and this little clock thing will go down. So yeah, it's just thought that you might guys might want to know that. So yeah, subscribe, rate, and comment.